whoa, everyone, this is like super early in the morning. I was preparing my daughter. Then I scroll through a bit on my YouTube, right? It's like, whoa, I got stunned by Chigu Chong. Thank you, Chigu Chong. Okay, so I've been teaching my center of rotation using like a few methods, lah, right? Because to cater for like different different students. So the more methods I have, the, the more powerful students will get. Like it will covers larger percentage of students. Lah. That's my other gene teaching. Okay, so let me tell you something. Let's ignore all the what? Anti-clockwise, clockwise, everything. Okay, this one is like one hundred percent ninety degrees already because this one is a method that cater for ninety degree related rotation point. Okay, everyone. Now, so ignore the object image, ignore everything. The complete full video you can check out my full guide on transformation. You can DM me, I can send you the link. You can go into channel and check it out. <gasps> okay, let's go into that. Okay, now so the things like this. So I want to get the center rotation right. Okay, students, look at this. So let's focus on corresponding points. Ah, huh? ah, see. So I will take this point. Ah, huh? and this point. Why? Huh? Because ninety ninety. Huh? Okay, if I say you don't want to, you say, did you, can I use other points or not? Can, but make sure corresponding. So maybe you can take like A compared to what? A obviously compared to J, something like that. Okay, let's say I take something easier for you to see. So D to H, I see. Oh, don't get stuck, I tell you. So I draw a line. Okay, then so don't say, I thought draw a line is like harder. No, I tell you, everything just got stunned me like right in the morning. Then I share with my daughter and she doesn't say, <laughs> come on, do it slowly. Okay, so this one. So we, we will look at, we will look at the right angle triangle that we can form according to this slide like, because it's like hypotenuse, you know. So we have like one, two, three, four, five, six. Come on, that's the right angle triangle, right? Like. So student will say, teacher, I thought normally we do something like four, two, something like that one. Yeah, normally do that, right? But no need. You count as like six unit, uh, two sides of the right angle triangle, right? You see, yeah? six divided by two equals to three. Then you go anyway, take D point, H point, so okay, then you count, you know. So I count, uh, one, two, three, stop. Then from this point, right, you notice this line is a right angle triangle, right? Like, and the 90 degree of the right angle triangle is here, you know. Then what you do, you see, what you do, you see, yeah, see, yeah, see, yeah, don't blink your eye, you know. This line, right, from your 90 degree, uh, you flip, then it's like, bang, go to this, you know, go to this. Then this is your rotation point, sir. Okay, you don't believe, right? Okay, because it happens to me. I'm like, what the heck? Okay, because normally when I when I uh, review a method, right, I will try it not using like one 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 point. I will try multiple points and try to try to break this myth and say impossible, but oh my god, this is stunning. Okay, you see, I try A, uh, you see, uh, just like I say A to J, ma. Okay, A to J, ma, I see. Wow. Then I count, I see, I count, I start counting, uh, start counting, uh, see, uh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. You see, I'm shaking. I'm so scary. You see, this method is crazy. So 14 divided by 2, you get 7. Uh. Okay, anyway, start from A, start from G, also can. Uh. So you see, I count. Uh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Stop. The 90 degrees here. Uh. Then there's one line there. I see one line. Uh. Uh, then from this 90, you flick, you know. Bah! Then, oh my gosh, you stop at the same. I got stunned. Okay, never mind. Then I, I say, I don't believe again, you know. Okay, so same like you all, uh, you all also don't believe one. You say, sure, no, teacher. You try straight line. Okay, I try. You see, I try straight line. Because straight line, you cannot form right angle triangle. Yeah, I try already, you know. But Chigu Chong channel didn't mention this straight line thing. So I notice it and I'm like, I go and, I go, I go and talk to like Chigu Chong. I say, Chigu Chong, thank you very much. This is crazy. Okay, now, so, so here to here, right? Like, you see, this line, this line C is to like corresponding line of L, right? You see, uh, then you say, oh, you teacher, this one, uh, die already, oh, cannot do, oh. Never mind. We, we change a bit. We have to be innovative. Uh. So you see, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Uh. Then six divided by two. Uh. Then you get three. Uh. Right, uh, I'm sorry, you get three. Uh. Then three is here, you know. Then teacher, no right angle triangle. How? Never mind. You go to this, then you flip upwards, it's like, bah, my gosh, you hit the same point, everybody. Then, then I said again, you know, I said again to myself, I said, I don't believe, I try again. <sighs> yeah, try again, see, uh, I take this one, you know, then I draw to, draw to K. Then it counts, like, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10 divided by 2, 10 divided by 2 equals to 5. Then I go 5, it's like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 9, mm -hmm, 5. Then I come back to here, flip, then 4, same point. Students, do you understand my feeling or not? <sighs> it's so easy. Okay, yeah, thanks, bye.